batteries is growing in importance and primarily what is driving this now is the electrification of the vehicle sector. But also batteries will come into play when it comes to other parts of the energy system, such as energy storage for windmills, sun power. It will be absolutely necessary that we scale this up. We need a lot more of it and we need to make it better. My name is Daniel Brandell. I'm a professor of materials chemistry at Uppsala University, Sweden and I work a lot with lithium-ion battery technology. We also need to see much more versatile battery chemistries and the development of the batteries themselves in terms of cost, in terms of sustainability, in terms of performance. Batteries that are free from conflict minerals, all of this needs technical development and quite a lot of research. There will be a huge number of bottlenecks that we need to overcome, both when it comes to materials and the processing and the processing equipment and the recycling, etc. We need to fix this with the current chemistries and the current technologies. Sweden has quite a good setting. Pioneers that have started gigafactories in Sweden. Vehicle industry that traditionally has been very strong in Sweden and is also at the forefront of electrification. Quite a robust energy system and a green energy system. We have a lot of know-how from researcher groups that has worked a long time on batteries. And this means that we have a local ecosystem which is quite appealing if one would like to advance in this technical area. The ambitions by the gigafactories being built in Sweden, we have four right now that are planned for, is to have a very high degree of recycling. What they have pioneered right now is actually to make a new battery out of only recycled material. It shows the potential of having this technology on board.